Michelle Yeoh has made her mark on Hollywood with blockbuster films like Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon, Crazy Rich Asians, and last year's Everything, Everywhere, All at Once, a role, by the way, which landed her an Oscar for Best Actress. Yeah, now Michelle stars as the matriarch of a crime family in the action dramedy The Brother's Son on Netflix. Take a look. You see a basement full of chatty old women. I see a complex network of relationships, favors, and debts. They're gossips, not spies. If you want to know about politics, you go to Mrs. Cheng. She works at the mayor's office. And if you want to know about the church, ask Mrs. Liu. Her husband is the pastor of the Chinese church. And if you want to know anything about Pastor Liu, ask Mrs. Wong. She is having an affair with him. I'm already in. <laughs> we are in. I love this vibe. I mean, what is so much fun about this show is that it, it bends genres. Yes. It's it's everything, yes. everything, all the time. Everything, yeah. everywhere, all again, the all the time. Yes, it's hilarious. It is uh, full mm -hmm. of heart. Mm -hmm. It's also got some major action. Parts. Oh my God, the action is so creative as yeah. well. Um, but what I love really is this genre has not really been seen on American TV. Yeah, the mafia, the triads. But how do we tell a story like this without you cringing and going like, okay, maybe we don't want to know about that dark, dark world. But you know, it's dark comedy. And so when it all happens together, you're actually, going, I'm laughing. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually quite funny. <laughs> but what really bonds us all together is about family. Yeah. I mean, that's the universal language, yes. right? What you would do for family and what family does for you. You are the matriarch, but you do have um, some action involved. Yes. Action and we were looking back into your history. You never really studied any of these martial arts, but you did study dance. Mm -hmm. And that was kind of a key mm -hmm. to helping you know how to play these scenes, right? I think if you think about it, dance, but martial arts, sports, it's all body. Yeah. Right? It is the movement, yeah. it is your coordination, your agility, the, the, the ability to master how you move, I gracefully or yeah. <laughs> punch, Ooh. right? Huh? So, um, but I have had, and I still do, the best masters. Like my stunt coordinators, they are the ones that make me look good. Yeah. Like Justin Yu, who did uh, The Brother's Son. I mean, mm. he made Justin Chen and the rest of us look spot on. Uh, so it is It is the dance that has helped me. It's given me a grace. Yeah. When you were a girl, you mm -hmm. studied dance. Did you Did you only want to dance? Was it your mm -hmm. major dream? Mm -hmm. And I read yes. you had a spine injury. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yes. I went to England to continue my studies in dance. You know, mm -hmm. I, at that time, I thought, this is my world. I want to be in ballet. I want to be dancing from the morning I wake up, the moment I wake up till mm -hmm. the end of the day. And I did that for a little while and unfortunately um, I had a back injury that just shattered yeah. that the the basically the specialist just said sorry no more that no not this kind of dancing yeah. it's too much pressure on your spine well if that guy sees what I'm doing now <laughs> exactly. <laughs> but I think it's so interesting because a lot of people might have gotten that news and gone down a very dark path for yeah. a very long time but you seem to pick up the pieces and find another lane, another route. I was very blessed. I think, you know, in life, you if you're surrounded by good vibes and good people, and the, the principal of the Hammond School where I was at said, she opened my eyes and she said to me, basically, she said, dance is so vast. It's not just about ballet. You could be a choreographer. You could do this. You could <laughs> oh, do and so after that it, yes. And you know when you're a 16 17 year old, yeah. you need guidance. You need yeah. you, if you're very lucky, you will have someone who comes along the way mm -hmm. and gives you a gentle yes. nudge in the right and open a window or open another door for you and that was what she did. Mm -hmm. But I never thought that it would lead me to the world of the movies. Yeah. Wow. Lead you to be an uh, Oscar winner. Yeah. <laughs> you dedicated that Oscar to your mom. Of course. Has, what, 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 do you, what, what do you owe to her? Mm -hmm. How did she make you know that you were enough? Mm -hmm. You know, the, that's a very good word. My mom and dad always said, I wish you enough. And I think that's I very wish you enough. enough. Yeah. We're stealing that. Uh, that so yeah. tell us. And yeah. that that is really it tells you learn how to be content, to be satisfied, but keep fighting for what you believe in and do your best always. Um, 
my mom, I wouldn't be sitting here without our moms, right? None yeah. of us would be here. Yeah. And uh, she was really the one who pushed me to, in this direction. Never thought that I would be an actress. Actually, she's much more better at this than I am. <laughs> <laughs> but I remember sitting there uh, just before it, they would announce the, the, the results for the best actress. I was thinking, oh my God, my mom is with like quite a few, a number of people in Malaysia because they got out very early oh, because of the time yes. difference to watch it. And I go, what is going to happen if I didn't, if I lost? <laughs> I would never be able to go home Maybe again. Maybe she's enough. Maybe she's just <laughs> saying enough. You're enough. Michelle, you're yes, you're enough. right. Because at that yeah. time, you know, you, you're constantly reminded, you won the SAG, you won this, yes. you already yeah. nominated, you already broke a lot of glass yes. ceilings. Yes. You know, mm -hmm. but, but, I think what, why at that moment you think enough is when the rest of the world also gets gratification as well. Because today when I see the young people, yes. when they come up, they look at me and they go, you've changed my life because you make me know that I can do more. It's possible. Mm, beautiful. Yeah. Ugh, okay, we just want to weep. We have to talk wicked. Yes. Oh, yeah, okay. wait. First of all, were you, I mean, you're, were, you're are you a singer? <laughs> Uh, I knew John Chu. Yeah. So John Chu calls me and he says, I would love for you to read this script. And I said, John, I would do anything for you. So he sends me the script. I call him back and go, John, you realize she sings, right? <laughs> you realize I don't sing, right? And he goes, eh, you'll be fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> That's what I love about John. And he really just wanted me to, to play that part. Yeah. And you know, you get very attracted to there is a I believe that I will work only with people who are passionate yeah and I truly want you to be there because otherwise you're wasting my time yes and then I get this video from uh, Ariana and Cynthia saying it's imperative that, that you come, come and join us <laughs> imperative were you nervous when yeah. you first had to sing in front of these two <laughs> Fine. Not nervous. But you did it. I yes. You, did. you know, and I had Cynthia going, sing it out. I know you can do it. Oh, okay, she was... so, oh yeah. Because uh, we recorded, we oh, practiced, right. and right. they did make it so much fun yeah. that at the end of the day you thought, oh well, you know, what can go wrong? <laughs> I love you are, that. You are such a delight. You're so many things. Oh, but you're thanks. just a great, great, great company. Thanks you for are. sitting Thank with you, us, Michelle. Michelle. This is such a fun show. Catch <laughs> the brother-son. It is streaming right now on Netflix.